Hey, I'm Les with Judson Vacuum. I want to make a video on our cleaning products and basically we have what you might have heard is the O2 system. I want to give you an update with the O2 system, its capabilities, and I want to talk about the cost effectiveness of the O2 system and what we, our objective when we designed the O2 system, what we wanted it to do. The O2 system, the objective and our mission when we designed this was to uh, come up with fewer bottles on the truck. We are not required to stock and inventory lots of different products for different fibers. So what we did is we have a three component system called the O2 system. It consists of a pre-spray. The pre-spray is delimaline solvent. It is a borate as far as an oxygen brighter, brightener and our disinfectant properties. I'll talk about how that works. We have a, an extraction chemical. It's called the O2 neutral rinse. It's neutral, it's not an acid, and it's not an alkali, it's a neutral rinse. And the capabilities of the O2 system, there's nothing on the market like it, and it's very, very cost effective. Um, and I'll get into the, the actual cost savings of using the O2 system and the safety of the O2 system. We have another product here called Hot Sauce Modifier. This is not a booster. What it actually does is it changes the total formula into a different pre-spray for different applications of uh, like super dirty carpets. So I'll start off with talking about um, um, cost savings with the O2 system. When we made the O2 system, I wanted to use only American-made raw materials, nothing from any other country. So a lot of times I got a lot of cost in certain uh, certain raw materials, uh, three, four times more cost than if I had bought something from a foreign country. But I wasn't really concerned about the cost or how much it was going to cost me. I wanted it to have the capabilities to do what I wanted. So what we did is we now have a pre-spray that's maximum concentration. You cannot make a pre-spray any stronger than this. It takes us two days to uh, manufacture the O2 system to process it, to concentrate it as high as we do have it. So it's at a maximum concentration. Recommended dilution ratio is two ounces to a gallon. In some cases you can go to one ounce if it's not that dirty. But two ounces a gallon is our recommended dilution ratio for probably 60-70% of the jobs you'll come across. You can mix it a little stronger if you have dirtier carpets. Now, we wanted it to be a versatile system, so the O2 system will clean wool. Well, how do we do that? We're doing that with a low pH system. To compensate for having a low pH, we have a higher percentage of material in the bottle. So it's a stronger chemical, so it kind of compensates for it being a lower pH system, but allows us to do wool and allows us to do warranty fifth generation carpets, not void the warranty. Delamoline is hard to rinse out, so we bought food grade delimaline. Now I want you to look how clear this is. That looks like water, it's not water. Uh, food grade delimaline is crystal clear, technical grade's kind of uh, yellowish color, it's kind of more oily. So we're buying the best, highest quality delimaline food grade, so it's a higher quality product so it rinses good. Delimaline is from the oranges the peeling of an orange, when you squeeze the peeling of an orange, the little clear bubbles that come up on the peeling, that's the, the, the turpin, the delimaline. So that we're buying the best, highest quality delimaline you can find. The next product we have is the hot sauce modifier, which is something you incorporate into the system for special applications. If you're doing olefin carpets or something extremely dirty, it allows us to not use as much pre-spray. In other words, if you were normally going to reuse four ounces to a gallon, now stay with two ounces and add a half of a tablespoon of the hot sauce modifier. Now, the little scooper that comes with this, this is a half of an ounce. A lot of people mistake that with a full ounce. Because we do not have fillers in our powders, we don't have potash, or any type fillers like that, you, so you, basically one half ounce 
equals probably two ounces of a comparable product that would be uh, have uh, three parts potash or caustic soda. That's, a, that's what is used for a filler. So you're buying two pounds of pure chemical with no filler with a hot sauce modifier. The, um, the neutral rinse has borate, sodium borate, which has oxygen brightening properties, it's disinfectant properties. We also have a um, surfactant that gives it cleaning ability. Also the borate gives it cleaning ability. We also, by leaving using borate, when you're extracting, the moisture that's left in the carpet continues to brighten dingy areas. It deals with um, wicking issues because you're just trying to get up through the borate that's in the carpet. What happens to the borate? It turns into hydrogen peroxide and evaporates off the fiber, so we don't have any residue left with the borate. The, also, we have a drying agent in this extraction chemical. This accelerates the drying of the carpet. Now, when you, if you want to maximize the benefit of that, you put an air mover down after you extract and it really accelerates the drying. If you don't put an, a fan down, you may not see the drying times decrease dramatically, but if you put a fan down after this, it really accelerates the drying. Both of these have high power disinfectant deodorization. The borate for every ounce of pre-spray that you put into a gallon of water, you're getting 500 parts per million of a disinfectant that is a deodorizer and it's also the oxygen brightener. The O2 system has been out for seven years now and we've only had one issue where a customer was actually allergic to delimaline and had you know, a reaction to it. Other than that, we've had no carpets bleached, we've had no health issues, We've had no stainless steel refrigerators uh, get etched out. It's a very safe chemical. And like I said, we're using mainly American-made raw materials. So I want to talk about the cost savings of having the O2 system. These three bottles here have cleaned every fiber that there is. We I even have customers that are cleaning Haitian cotton couches with it. Now to do this, remember, this is a low pH system, and then you use your neutral rinse, which leaves the fiber in a neutral pH, and that's how we're able to do wool carpets with it. And uh, this is 16 ounces to a 5 gallon, inject between 2 and 3 on your flow meter. The pre-spray is 2 ounces to a gallon, and uh, for something real bad, you might put 4 ounces and maybe a half tablespoon I mean a half ounce of the hot sauce modifier. Before we came out with the hot sauce modifier, people were putting like six, eight ounces for real trash carpets. And the reason we developed this product was to save the carpet cleaner money, not for us to make more money, because basically when we came out with the hot sauce modifier, we lowered the sales of the pre-spray because you don't use as much of it. In other words, instead of using six to eight ounces for dirty carpet, you might use four ounces in one tablespoon or one half ounce scoop of the hot sauce modifier and that saves four or five ounces of pre-spray. So we're doing this to try to get it as cost effective as possible. And I just, if you've not used the O2 system, it replaces so many different products. Um, you can use it straight on gum for a gum gel. You can mix four ounces to a quart two of these in a quart together and it makes a great spotter. It's kind of strong. Because it's a polymer base, it rinses very good. Um, another thing, if you're doing um, the capabilities to take care of a water claw, you're doing a pet stain, we like to incorporate this product called Quadalot. Quadalot is a 25% four component quaternary ammonia. Uh, this is the most powerful quad on the market. And like I say, it's a four component, so it's, it's a broader spectrum of um, germs that will eliminate odor-causing germs. And what we like to do is put four ounces of pre-spray, two ounces of Quadalot per gallon, treat your stain like you normally would for a water claw, like a pet stain. And what's so unbelievable about this mixture with the Quadalot and the pre-spray is we now have our oxygen brighteners, 
We have our emulsifiers, we have surfactants to clean the stain, 500 parts per million borate disinfectant. For every ounce of quad it's 1,988 parts per million of disinfectant. When you mix four ounces of this, two ounces of this per gallon, we're approaching 8,000 parts per million of disinfectant. Any other product on the market, you can't really get it that powerful or it'll actually damage the carpet or bleach the carpet out. Sodium percarbonate, if you get it too strong and trying to get even close to those uh, parts per million, you really can't get it that strong. Uh, it can bleach dark colored carpets out, so it's very safe. We're able to get the power up and it not be uh, dangerous to use or risk bleaching or damaging the carpet. Uh, so, the, it, like I say, this replaces all these specialty chemicals. It probably eliminates you from having to stock 20 different products, you know, when you go uh, see all these uh, different types of chemicals for different fibers, specialty. By being able to mix this at different ratios, you can actually clean everything that's been out there. It's been done. Uh, it's been out for little, almost seven years, and we got good success. Now, I just want to talk about cost effectiveness of the O2 system. Let's say that you're using a product that costs $35 a gallon and it says that it's a four ounce to a gallon uh, dilution ratio. So the dilution ratio at $35 a gallon and we're, we're going to buy a case of that chemical. So four gallons at $35 a gallon that's $140 um, for the chemical. And then you basically you got to what twenty five dollars a case to ship it, just average. Sometimes it's more, sometimes it's less, and so that gives us uh, two cases. Okay, four ounces to a gallon. You would have to buy two cases of the four ounce to a gallon chemical versus the two ounces. So it's a comparison of the chemical in the bottle. So you'd have to buy two cases. That's a two hundred and eighty dollars. Plus, you've got to buy pay shipping of $25 per case. That gives us $330 uh, comparable product you would have to buy if it says four ounces recommended dilution ratio per gallon. The O2 system comparable material, you would buy one case, four gallons, $42.50 a gallon, $170 per case, plus the $25 shipping. That's $195 that will replace $330. See the savings there by buying a higher concentrated chemical. Even though you're paying less per gallon, by the time you put in the uh, shipping per, you know, it, it's $195 versus $330. So that's a good savings. If you've got a lot of trucks and you're consuming a lot of chemical, at the end of a year it can be a quite a bit of money that you can save and having the capabilities of cleaning any fiber. So, I mean, if you go to a house and they happen to have a delicate wool carpet, you can go ahead and clean it with this. If it's rayon, olefin, any kind of carpet, you can clean the upholstery. If it's, if, if it's any type of material, it's, the O2 system's been cleaned, been used on everything. So I just wanted to talk about the O2 system. If you've not used it, I think you would be real happy with it once you get the O2 system. Uh, give me a call if you got certain jobs and I will um, talk to you about how to mix the hot sauce modifier and ratios with the O2 system and put that fan down and see how fast you can get that carpet dry. Remember the sooner we dry the carpet we dealt with that wicking issue because once it dries it can't make it to the surface of the fiber.